Hey guys, it's another mini awesome cast, Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter at Awesome Cast is where you can find all kinds of stuff about uh, what we're talking about in tech here uh, going on. And of course, uh, yesterday we had the uh, big announcements, the huge announcements, and of course one of the eh, sort of surprising, surprising in a little bit of the direction they're going, was the uh, new MacBook. Not a Pro, not an Air, it's just a MacBook. Uh, one, it definitely comes in um, very iPhone-ish colors, uh, including you're going to have an awesome gold MacBook, apparently. Um, but also interesting, you know, and oh, there's that keyboard, of course, it's very kind of scrunched in there. And it's supposedly with bigger keys, I guess. Um, the thinnest, you know, of course, we're talking about Apple here. Um, but really intriguing, and uh, I'll see if I can pull up a picture here for you guys, a video. Uh, but they got into the internals. It's amazing how much the logic board is. Um, you know, they kept saying, like, this is this is iPad technology really applied here, and how miniature it is, and uh, how they've just reserved all the rest of that space, though not much because it's so thin, but still a lot of surface area there is really dedicated to battery now, um, which is going to, you know, make this a pretty, pretty decent um battery life uh, kind of kind of thing here um a chip seems like it's a very mobile uh kind of one uh starts at 1200 dollars um and uh it's i don't want to say it's a no compromise there's compromises when you go that thin there's compromises uh the fact that they got you know they're down to like two ports you know uh, you're going to be full of dongles um and they, i don't think this is going to be for a <laughs> I don't think this is going to be for a uh, a Final Cut editor or anything like that, uh, but for somebody who's, you know, doing some pretty powerful-ish word processing or anything else, um, a podcaster or whatnot, uh, a podcaster that has money for dongles, I guess, um, they're already talking about the, the dongles that that are going to go with this. There's not even a, uh, an Ethernet adapter to this. Um, how are, they're getting this accomplished is that one port on the side is actually a USB-C, which is the new standard. Um, so it's reversible. It, it carries the power. Um, so it, it And there's a breakout that will give you display and a regular USB and, and the power to be able to use at the same time. Um, it's compromise. It's, it's definitely compromises. But if you really want that 12-inch, super, super thin thing, um, it's a nice laptop. It looks like it's a really nice laptop. I'd be too afraid to break it myself. Um, I get worried enough with the thinner, lighter uh, MacBook Pro that I have. That's a, I think it's a late 2012 uh, that I have sporting around here. Um, but uh, again, Apple really kind of pushing the envelope as far as their designs. Um, and really kind of sticking out there and, and separating themselves from the pack as far as those go. Um, is it Who is it for? I don't know, because the people I know that want like a nice, small, thin uh, laptop, maybe not going for the $1,200. Um, but uh, still, a really nice, pretty. It's pretty, and that's what Apple does best, is, is make a pretty enviable technology. And uh, I think they did the same here. Um, so what do you think about the new MacBook? Is it something you're looking to pick up if you're a MacBook Air lover um, in comparison? And uh, let, me, let me know in the comments here on YouTube. And let us know at AwesomeCast on the Twitter and um, over, you know, anywhere else. You can find us, AwesomeCast, on the uh, Facebooks and the Google+. Plus. we got the great AwesomeCast group going on as well with a lot of conversation um, on uh, Facebook as well. I will see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.